What is up guys, it's Dawson the TV here, and I want to talk about Ghost of Tsushima 2. Now, I know a lot of people are going to be like, wait, 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 wait a minute, we just got the expansion. We just got the expansion, so there's no need to talk about Ghost of Tsushima 2, you're crazy. No, there's never a time to be not talking about video games, especially video games that you really like. And you want this game to... Continue. You want the franchise to keep expanding, right? So, Ghost of Tsushima 2. I'm going to be talking about a lot of things. I'm going to be... T First of all, I want to talk about when we could be getting Ghost of Tsushima 2. And this is the thing. I really don't know. I wish I did, but I don't. Because there's a lot of things going on right now. We are getting hints of... Another Sly Cooper game. We are... There's also... In the Ghost of Tsushima game... There is a shit ton of... Easter eggs of the infamous games. Which I'm not saying they're bad games at all. But I would love for them to... Just continue what... Is fucking great. Which is Ghost of Tsushima. Just... You know... I wouldn't... See them just like... Abandoning Ghost of Tsushima right away after all the excess just to go towards another game. Maybe they would, I don't know. But, yeah. And they did the same with Infamous. Like, when Infamous done very well, the first Infamous, it took them a couple of years for the next Infamous, Infamous 2. So, because that game did very well, and then after Infamous 2, they went to Infamous Second Son, and then after Second Son, they don't go to Tsushima. So they could do this, they could go around the same pattern. And I know there is a lot of people, including myself, that would like to see a Sly, another Sly Cooper game. But when we talk about, like, the team, about, you know... The, the amount of people that would work on Ghost of Tsushima and Sly Cooper, you know, there'll be a big difference. Now, I'm not saying there is a small amount of people who are going to be working on Sly Cooper, but I'm just talking about when it comes to a giant game like Ghost of Tsushima that is much more bigger in comparison than the Sly Cooper games. But yeah, I would love to see a Sly Cooper, but more of all, I would like to see another Ghost of Tsushima so, we could be getting that next, we could, I really don't know, but the fact is, we are getting, there is a high, high, high possibility, I can say even a fact, we are going to be getting a Ghost of Tsushima too, and I'm going to be talking about first, there is a lot of hints <laughs> Throughout the game, even the DLC, about people going to the mainland because they are... The, the Sashima and Eki is invaded by Mongo, so they want to go out of there, right? It's throughout the game that is their main objective to go to the mainland. The mainland of Japan. And, yeah, you, you could say, well, that's not really enough, is it? Like, to say there is a, another ghost is the same. Well, yeah, true. But there is also <clears throat> the, the, the big thing about this, and I had no idea about this after I completed the game. This game is all based on history. It's all based on history. I'm not saying the entire game is based on history. But most part, when it comes to the events, it's based on history. There, I mean, there's no Jin Sakai. There is no Lord Shimura. There's no Clan Sakai. That is all fiction. But the things that happened, the events, the samurai were real. The Mongols were real. It was, it, it's all there. And I was doing a lot of reading up after I finished the game. And yeah, the 14th century, it was the 14th or the 17th century, the Mongols attacked Tsushima. They attacked Tsushima and then 
the samurai drove them away. And it was by, this was all by Genghis Khan. Now, Genghis Khan, which is really awesome, Genghis Khan is actually, well, Kun Khan is the grandson of Genghis Khan. Which is so awesome. So they still kind of have like, you know, they put some real events into it, but they mix it with non like fiction characters. So yeah, Kun Khan was not a real character, but they still portrayed a lot of good events, right? So after Sashima, they went on to Iki. So yeah, after Sashima, it was Iki Island. Mongols went over there, and then basically the same thing. The, the samurai and the raiders, they drove them away. And it's not like the story about how the people hate the samurai and Ikeas. It, it's just basically good storytelling out of Sucker Punch. But they, again, the events are still there. And if they were to make, and I'm actually happy about this, if they were to make a Ghost of Tsushima 2 based on Iki Island, that would be the most smallest game ever. It would be more small than the first game, obviously, because I don't know how the map size is. That game will take you at least 10 to 12 hours to complete. So, yeah, I'm actually happy they made that into a DLC. So, <clears throat> sorry about that. After Iki Island... They went to Hakata Bay. Don't know where Hakata Bay is. Let me pull the Google Maps. Hakata Bay is just at the mainland of Japan. Is that not enough for you? Is that not enough for you to, like, say there's going to be another Ghost of Tsushima? Okay, one more thing, one more thing. Just after Ghost of Tsushima came out, there is, there was job listings... For people that know a lot about Japanese culture. Again. This is a based on history. So they're looking for people. And people have like a lot of knowledge for these events. So there is going to be a ghost of Tsushima. Another ghost of Tsushima. Not saying the same character being gonna is gonna be Jin. Could be a different one, could be a different protagonist, which I hope not, because we all know what happened with Second Son. Like, we were all pissed about what happened with Cole. But yeah. These are all big facts that we are going to get a ghost of Tsushima too. And the mainland, of course. And it's much more bigger than Tsushima. Like, Jesus Christ. There's going to be a lot of exploring. And I'm going to be talking soon why one scene goes to Tsushima too. But that'll be later on. But yeah. Let me know what you guys think about Ghost of Tsushima 2. And especially being in the mainland. And did you know this was all based on history? Because I didn't. I only knew after the game. So make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Dawson TV is out.